Hey Reds! Welcome to Manchester United's breaking news channel. Here you can stay updated with the latest and hottest news about our mighty United. Subscribe to the channel now so you don't miss out on the latest updates. Harry Maguire is edging closer to leaving Manchester United. The English centre-back is not in Eric Ten Hag's plans, with the Dutch coach eager to streamline the squad and mount a title challenge in the upcoming season. Eric Ten Hag intends to offload Harry Maguire, Fred, Scott McTominay, and Jadon Sancho in the next two weeks to kickstart a much-needed streamlining of the Manchester United squad as he seeks to mount a title challenge in the next season. The Dutch coach has reportedly made definitive decisions on whom he wants to keep, in a situation that has been compared to Mikel Oteta's first full summer at Arsenal. Ten Hag understands that a group works best when everyone is fully focused and involved, and it is better to let go of those who do not fit into long-term plans. This puts Maguire in a tricky position, especially since England manager Gareth Southgate has told him he needs to play regularly in the Premier League to secure his place for Euro 2024. West Ham United is among the clubs that have shown interest but have been discouraged by the cost of the deal. The Old Trafford hierarchy has set a value of £50 million, but buying clubs believe he is available for £35 million. The main issue with Maguire remains his high salary. Click the like button on the video. This way, you'll receive more updated videos about Old Trafford. This has actually been United's primary obstacle in their long-standing struggle to sell players. Many players are on high salaries from previous management regimes, and potential buyers are unwilling to match those high wages, resulting in players being unwilling to move. Nevertheless, Ten Hag has made it clear about his hierarchy in central defence, with Victor Lindelof as the main replacement and Luke Shaw seen as the second option. This leaves Maguire with a decision, but currently, there aren't many suitable takers. A loan is a potential option. Meanwhile, Fulham still retains interest in Fred, and both West Ham United and Newcastle United have been monitoring Scott McTominay, depending on their own movements. It is expected that Arsenal will conduct medical tests with Declan Rice in the next 48 hours, which will likely accelerate West Ham's plans to replace the English midfielder amidst a new recruitment structure. It is understood that Sancho has been considered as a possible sale to Tottenham Hotspur, but there hasn't been much feedback yet. Ideally, United would see him as part of any deal for Harry Kane, but the future of the English record scorer remains uncertain and is widely seen as someone who could unlock the rest of the transfer market. Although Kane's preference would be to move to Old Trafford, it is currently considered highly unlikely due to the difficulties of negotiating with Daniel Levi. As of now, United is planning without him, and one of their targets for the summer is to bring in Inter goalkeeper Andre Onana and potentially Atalanta's Rasmus Hodgland, in addition to Mason Mount, with further signings dependent on sales. And you, United fan? Would you like Maguire to stay in the team? Leave your opinion in the comments.